Hi, this is Snowy Boy, and um, welcome to my review of uh, a cool blue warrior. Um, she has some air tubes. Um, they're attached from her neck around her body, and back to the other side of the neck. And yes, she is supposed to be a Mari Nui warrior, but instead in the movie, well, um, uh, I'm, I'm planning to make a movie. In fact, I have a part of the movie saving right now. Um, it's called Bionicle Adventure for the Master Life, but it's my own movie. And it takes place on Voi Nui, but she's supposed to be a Mari Nui warrior. So, um, <coughs> yeah. This is her shield. Um, it's basically like um, two Hordiga lower arm pieces, the light blue from Gedunka, and then I put a Tachodox mask on there. She has um, a wrist mounted Medex Sky Blaster. Um, uh. Excuse me. And her legs. Um, are Tolmai Nupara's legs, but in Titan form, because you put like a two plus rod in the back of the handpiece and put a handpiece there, and there's like a Paraka leg, and here's the Titan leg part. Um, this is the roundest, roundest chest piece. The piece is um one of those Anika foots with the this. And her ma her head and mask. I can show you how to build it. In fact, it's pretty interesting too. All you need for the head and mask. Oh yeah. If you're wondering who this Matorn is, it's um the Matorn for this warrior, but. I'm still working on the movie. I'm just waiting for it to save. Okay. All you need is Galley Mata's mask. It can be in any color, which you can find the mask accessory pack. Uh, you need a Metro head. No eyepiece. One of these pieces with the two holes in the plus on another side. And, uh, like, one of these pieces with the stub. A two, a two plus rod, and one of these Lego bricks. It can be in blue or black. It's basically like a plate, but it's round. Yeah. First, you take the he Metro head and the Lego plate, and you put it on the hole, like the stubby part where it says Lego at the top. You put it on here. It actually fits well. And you take this. And put it in. It can be in red for an eyepiece. And you put it in the here. So you should have something like this. Actually, wait. You you don't need this piece. And then you put on your galley mask. And you see that little stub right there. You have to put it on this hole. And yes, it's supposed to be one of those masks like Makuta and Vizans. It's supposed to be a twistable mask. Like you'll see in my movie. But uh, I'm not making a trailer. I repeat, I'm not making a trailer for the movie I'm uploading. But it will be split into different parts because it would be too long. Yeah, her head is pretty interesting. And now, cow cow powers activate. Shh. That's her Kanohi cow cow. Okay. I made um the shield because it's something a little unique from the other arm. You see that handpiece? Um, that's different to that because if that handpiece wasn't there, then it you wouldn't be able to put the shield at the front. 
I'll make a how to video um later. Okay. Calco powers unactivate. <laughs> and the Mari tubes don't attach onto the mask. Duh. Because um it's a twistable mask. She's um the god of the marine world. Well she's at least the um, Aqua Queen and blue is my favorite color, so that's why I made this Titan. Um, I might not take her apart um, until I'm doing the how-to video. And her feet, I didn't give her silver because there is black feet too. Mm. Her shoulder armor is Takadox's armor and with the blue visor on top of it. Yeah, sometimes blue visors aren't just useful for mask. They can be useful for armor too. And that's why I did on this warrior. The Medex Sky Blaster has blue ammo in it. And her seven hole rods right here. Um that is there because um I want to choose it. I use part from Gedunka, Halimari, um Takadox, Nocturne. Um let's see what else. Um Hydraxin, one Lego set and Copacanuva. Because I got this meat axe sky blaster from Copaca. I only have two on um, Fantoka sets, but that's um Merchant and Vegan and Copaca Nuva, but Merchant I I at least wanted one um Fantoka with um a meat axe sky blaster and one with a Tridex pod. But I like Copaca better than Merchant and Vegan. So anyways, her leg, the back part of the leg is sort of like Karzani, but not really. Um, and her neck um, is as tall as Hydraxon's. Oops, looks like I gotta stop. This is the end of my review.